I was surprised when Pope Francis suggested that Donald Trump is not a Christian or questioned his faith in God. I have to tell you that in all honesty, Donald Trump has acted like a Christian more than any other politician I've seen in a long time. And in that, Donald Trump want to take care of his family first, meaning the American people. He want to take care of home first. Donald Trump said that he will build a wall around the borders. And in building a wall around the borders, that's going to stop illegals from coming in, taking jobs, bringing in crime and drugs and whatever else that they are doing. Um, um, it will stop our enemies because there are people who want to kill us. It will stop them from just walking in from across the borders. Uh, it will help the black community in that a lot of these, if not all, most of these illegal aliens are coming in, gang members and others, and they are ending up in the black community. And they don't love black people. And so crime is out of control. Drugs are out of control. Every evil thing you can think of, and it's hurting black people. Many blacks are leaving Los Angeles, South Central Los Angeles, and moving back to the South because they are not protected by their politicians. Um, Donald Trump said that he would bring the economy back, jobs back. That's Christian-like. Unlike the other politicians who have allowed the jobs or sent them out of the country due to uh, high taxes and other restrictions, rules and regulations, Donald Trump would bring those jobs back. That's Christian-like. You take care of your home first, your family first. Donald Trump said that he would stop uh, Muslims from coming in until he can figure out what is going on because these people want to come in and kill us. That is Christian-like. And so I would think that the Pope would be praising Donald Trump for his Christian uh, attitude, taking care of home first. Now, if the Pope think that Donald Trump wanting to do those things shows a lack of faith in God, then the Pope should set the first example. And here's what I would suggest to the Pope. Tear down the walls of the Vatican. You have major walls surrounding and protecting you, sir. So if you want Trump to not build a wall around the United States to protect us, we the people, then you tear down the walls of the Vatican. And that will show us that you have faith in God, sir, if that's what it means. Um, I would suggest that you not have bodyguards and protection when you travel around the world. That would show that you believe in God. And you, should, you, Mr. Pope, should set the first example of what a Christian is. If Trump is doing the wrong thing by protecting us, then tear down that big, beautiful, 693 feet long wall that is protecting you from ISIS and the Taliban. I'm being told that the wall is 436 feet high. There's no way a Taliban is going to get across. <laughs> so the, the, the Pope should set the first example because he's truly showing a lack of love for the folks in this country, in the United States of America, by attacking Trump because he wants to protect us. It, it doesn't make sense. And how about all of those priests, those homosexual priests who molested young boys, and you guys hid them away and transferred them to other locations? And those priests who molested 
young girls. Where is the Christianity in the way that you guys dealt with that, Mr. Pope? And why are you getting involved in our politics anyway? Your job is to save souls, sir. And I really appreciate the way that Trump dealt with this. He spoke up for himself. He didn't even back down to the Pope questioning his faith in God because he, Donald Trump, want to protect we the people. How dare the Pope do that? I am reminded of the scriptures that says, uh, beware of false prophets. Jesus warned us of that. And the Bible tells us not to listen to false teachers. And if the Pope is against putting a wall around the borders of the United States of America to protect us, then it sounds like false teaching to me. My heart goes out to the Catholics who, for whatever reason, I, I don't know a lot about the Catholic religion, but it doesn't make sense to me that these people will follow a man, a Pope, who is acting like a politician and who is against protecting the American people. In my opinion, the Pope is a hypocrite. The Pope should set the first example, tear down the walls of the Vatican, open it up so ISIS and the Taliban and whomever else want to come in, they would love to take over the Vatican, believe me. Set the example first, Mr. Pope, then we will listen to you.